Over 500 local businesses will participate in a survey addressing the skills deficit in St. Lucia. Focusing on a labor market needs assessment, this survey is part of a broader World Bank Human Capital Resilience Project. Dr. Justin Pierre, Director of Research and Business Development with the Canadian research firm Dunn Pierre Barnett and Company Canada Limited, highlighted that the assessment will evaluate the existing skills, resources and certifications currently available on island. What we have been seeing is that there is, a, there is an absence or lack of, of proper data. And in order for, for us to make decisions as to the, the, the future of, of, of St. Lucia, as to what type of training we need, what, what type of skills we, we need, it's important that we collect their, their data. Officially, we were looking to do about 550. This is done with the, with the collaboration of the statistics department, in collaboration with the Minister of Education, in collaboration with uh, the, uh, um, the procurement um, our office and the project coordination unit, together with you know, Mr. Mr. Um, Dr. Rufina and all of the stakeholders. So it's, uh, it's a national uh, endeavor that is sponsored by the Government of St. Lucia, Ministry of Education, and also uh, it is supported by the World Bank. A training exercise was conducted on Friday, June 21st, 2024, to familiarize enumerators with the questionnaire, tools and techniques for conducting the survey. Deputy Director of Statistics Richard Harris expressed hope that enterprises will recognize the survey's value to both the country and their own businesses. Essentially, we have experience, substantial experience in the conduct of these types of surveys. Um, we hold a quarterly labor force survey that essentially collects information from the supply side of things. So we go to the households who supply labor to the establishments. This particular survey looks at the demand side. So we go to the establishments and ask them details concerning the demand for labor. Martha Joseph from the Central Statistical Office, one of the workshop facilitators, noted that despite the short time frame for conducting the survey, they aim to complete the enumeration process within two and a half to three months by leveraging modern technology in the field. It's a while we have moved away from paper. We now into computer assisted and this is where we use the software. So definitely they're going to use the tablet to collect the information. The enumerators will be equipped with a standardized uniform, a photo identification card, and a signed letter, all bearing the logo of the Central Statistical Office for easy identification. For the National Competitiveness and Productivity Council, Glenn Simon reporting.